Hey everybody, it's Arkai423 here, and I have yet another Let's Play. This time, it's going to be The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Um, I decided to do this because I... The be okay, so first of all, let me get this, uh... Let me get this, uh, let you guys know. This will not be, like, 100%. This is only going to be... Oh, thank you for purchase. Okay, this is only going to be, basically, like... A little fun playthrough, basically. I have... I have no idea what I'm gonna do, and this is kind of like a first look, basically, kind of like, like what I think of the game. Well, it's gonna be a walkthrough, basically. It's gonna be a whole, the whole game, but it's just gonna be me, me playing it, because I have never played this game. I have, it's me playing it blind, basically. I've never seen any let's play. I've only seen gameplay of reviews, like IGN reviewing it. So, basically, that's about it. It's hopefully it won't be like you guys can watch me do as I play it, but this will not be 100%. So let's go ahead and get started. You can play this game with either one of the controllers, Wii Motion Plus, and I have the I bought the the uh, special edition, so I have the gold Legend of Zelda controller. So it's pretty epic looking so far. Yeah, I know. All right, so hopefully my TV is not too loud. I kind of want to hear my own TV, so if you guys do hear it, I'll uh, make note of that and I'll uh, kind of fix it in the next episode. So connect the nunchuck to the Wii Remote. Already did. Uh, calibrate it. So we got to put it down. I remember doing this. All right, we calibrated it. All right, we point it to the screen. So let's go ahead and get this freaking. I'm so excited for this game. All right, this is a tale that you humans have passed down throughout through uncounted generations. It tells of a war of unmatched scale and ferocity, the likes of which will never be seen. I, I couldn't read the rest of that. On one dark, a fateful day, the earth cracked wide and malevolent forces rushed forth from the fissure. They mounted a brutal assault upon the surface, people driving the land into deep despair. They burnt forests to ash, choked the land's sweet springs and murder without hesitation. That's pretty gruesome if you think about it. People came from the like it's kind of like the underworld and or hell basically. I don't know. They did all this in their lust to take the ultimate power protected by her grace, the goddess. So it looks like uh, maybe like in the trailer you can see the harp. Maybe that's what it is. I think that's the harp that uh, Zelda. I think that it has the power she guarded was without equal. Handed down by gods of old, this power gave its holder the means to take any desire a reality. Such was the might of the ultimate power that the old ones placed in that in the care of the goddess. To prevent this great power from falling into the hands of the evil swarming lands, the goddesses gathered the surviving humans on an outcropping of the earth. She sent in the skyward, beyond the reach of the demonic hordes, beyond even the clouds. So pretty high up. With the humans safe, the goddess joined forces with the land dwellers and fought the evil forces, sealing them away. At least, at last, peace was restored to the surface. This is a tale that you humans have told for many ages, generation to generation. That's a good story. But there are other legends, long hidden away from memory, that are intertwined with this tale. Alrighty. So, we get to the main screen here. And I think I accidentally skipped a few things. I'm not sure if I did. I'm sorry. Um, Alright. So let's go ahead and create a new adventure. As you can tell, I've never played this. And I'm always going to go with Link, because I absolutely love the name Link. Link is my favorite character in any game I've ever played in my whole life. Zelda is my favorite game. Pokemon second. Oh my goodness, the Fissure again. Holy cow, what is that? It's Godzilla! Dang. 
That was pretty epic looking. The Legend of Zelda, 25th anniversary. It is the 25th anniversary, that's pretty cool. I, I lived the 25th anniversary, that's awesome. So we have our bird pet thingy, I think. And then another one. I don't know. I'm guessing the red one's ours. Seeing the red color is more uh, masculine than the purple is. The feminine. Oh, that looks so cool. By far the best graphics on the Wii. Alrighty then. Now here we are. Oh man. Rise Link, the time has come for you to awaken. You are fated to have a hand and a great destiny and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. Link. That was pretty cool. If you guys heard that, like, electronic, weird-looking sounded noise, it sounded pretty cool. <laughs> so I guess the bird dropped the mail thing that we needed. Oh, we hit okay. Good morning, Link. Wakey wakey. Double take. <laughs> ah, Zelda's got the good old humor that I like. Hey, sleepyhead. I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Rise and shine, Link. Today's the wing ceremony. Your promise to meet before be, me before it starts. Remember, you better not keep me waiting, Zelda. Alrighty, so we have the wing ceremony today. I'm no idea what that is, but I'm guessing we have to meet Zelda before we go. All right, so controls. Um, the nunchuck is pretty easy. We got dash. Let's see what open up here. We get the map here. Um. Okay, so with the nunchuck, you can select the floor you want to look at. So, okay, we look at that. Alrighty. And then we'll go ahead and click one. This is our gear. So our sword, heart pieces. Um, whoa. So there's a lot of things we have to get here. Alright, so turn the page. is the uh, the D-pad. Let's go ahead back and get out of here. And let's go look at two. And so two is our help. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and look. I know if we get a rupee here, we get five rupees. Go ahead and shut that back. I saw that in the gameplay, the um, the little IGN review. Uh, can we sit? Oh wow, we can sit. On, that's pretty neat. Um, is that all? Whoa. So if you press C, you can actually look around your room with your Wii remote. Oh, that's neat. Okay, let's go ahead and leave. Okay, so... Um... Let's talk to this guy here. Morning, Link. So today's the wing ceremony. Are you ready? All I'm saying is everyone else is out practicing at the plaza. But you seem pretty relaxed about the whole thing. Of course, the Crimson Loft Wing of yours is something special. I feel pretty confident riding him, too. My bird won the last ceremony, but even I don't think he could beat that red terror of yours. 
Of course, a bird's true speed in a race always comes down to the skill of the rider. I'm something of a bird researcher around here, so you know if you ever find yourself in need of some bird expertise, come see Pippet. So this guy's name is Pippet, alrighty. Um, where to next? How about we go in here and talk to this man? He looks important. Hey, Link, the day of the wing ceremony is finally upon us. It's time to put what you've learned to use. All those practice, practical skills I taught you, and all the academic power, pro, pro, proists, I don't know, instructor Horrell taught you. While we're at, at it, do you remember how to look around using C? Press C to look or take a look around at your surroundings. If you feel cursor, point the remote at the screen, and okay, so we already, I showed you guys that already. And so I guess we can, all right, we got that. Um, is there anybody back here? I wanna, let's see, maybe there's a secret, or not a secret, but maybe something important to look at. All right, yes, I guess not. Um, do we have anything that we can look over here? So far, we do not, all righty. Let's go ahead and leave. Um, okay, we can't do anything with that. We can't necessarily dash. Oh yeah, hey, look at that, okay. Link! If you're heading over to the plaza, the quickest way is out the door on the ground floor. The exit on the top floor is still locked, so you obviously can't get out there. What's talking? What's taking the lunch lady so long? I'm going to have a word with her. All right, so I guess we cannot go up there. So let's go ahead and look at a few things. Is this our bedroom? Yep, it's our bedroom. All right. Sorry, guys, went the wrong way there. All right. So how about this room? Alright, it's locked. I think the actually let's go ahead and check on the map. So that one's alright. So majority of the rooms are locked. So these two rooms right here are locked, so we cannot go through there. I'm guessing that's the way out, but we I don't want to leave just quite yet. So this is the restroom. Um <laughs> You can actually sit in the restroom. And it flushes! That's 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 uh that's that's perfect. Alrighty, so talk to this man. I, yeah, let's talk to him. Good morning, Link. Today's the big wing ceremony, right? I wanted to fly too, but I I didn't make the cut, so I'm stuck back here at the academy. Plus, I've got more things. I, I got to move these barrels over to the kitchen. I was hoping to at least to be able to cheer you on, Link, but I guess that's the way it goes. Go out there and wow them, buddy. So, I guess poor guy can't... Oh, snap! And you throw it by actually throwing the Wii Remote. That's neat. Um, come on, give us some rupees. For all time's sake, or give me insects. Nothing? Cheap. Um, so over here we got a pot, um, a fireplace, um, a big pot. Let's throw this sucker. What do you think you're doing? You better clean that up. Um, sorry, ma'am. So apparently that you get a little bit in trouble. Uh, I didn't realize that. Okay, that's okay, though. Where in the clouds is that fledge boy? He's supposed to be bringing me those barrels. Sometimes I just don't know what's going on in that boy's head. So I guess he's not listening at the moment. Or he's not doing his job like he is. He's probably going to tell me to clean up again, but... All right, she did it. All right, cool. All right. Now that we've done that, let's go ahead and run and go up in here. Let's go outside. The first time we go outside. Took a little minute for it to load. That's okay. We get some fantastic music. Skyloft. All right, cool. Uh, we got a gigantic statue, I'm guessing, is the goddess that uh, protected uh, the Skyloft area. So let's go ahead and look around. Um, hey! Hey, Link, up, the, up here! So I'm guessing this is probably going to be the Z targeting the dude, because this every game it's got it. Good morning to you, Link. Today is the, finally the, the day of the long awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered that there's something I like to ask you about. Look this way while pressing, holding Z, and then press A to chat with me. So there we go. Excellent. Always remember you can Z target something. Once you have targeted someone with Z, you can easily talk to him or her by pressing A. 
even and even when there isn't anything to target, pressing Z is a convenient way to quickly face your opponent or face him forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from this distance. Why don't you come up and join me up here? Alright, so he wants to join me, so we have to go up there and talk to him. We should climb using dash. Um, Alright, let's see here. Let's go ahead and Z target. Uh, can you actually... Let's see what this is. Alright, cool. So you can save. So let's go ahead and save. I haven't saved yet, and I like to save. Alright, so... Hopefully this isn't like Majora's Mask. That would suck. Alright, so let's dash... Whoa! Alright, so we get to do that. So what do you think? Using A to dash is useful, isn't it? However, don't dash around so much that you'll tire yourself out or your stamina gauge will empty and you'll be completely out of breath. It's best to take a little break when your stamina gauge gets close to empty. Got all that? On to the next point. You can jump a short distance like this just by moving toward it. I like to call it auto jump. Ah yes, auto jump. It's just having nice the ring to it. Alright, so I guess, just like every game, you get the little auto jump sequence. Go ahead and talk to him. So what are you up to? Rushing to get some last some some last minute bird riding practice in this morning, Link? Oh. You have someone to meet. Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, isn't she? Perfect timing then. You see, Zelda's father, headmaster Gaipora, has a pet named Mia. And well, she's scampered off again. Look! Over there. Do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony, I thought that maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony is about to start, and I just put on a fresh set of clothes. And well, you see, will you help me out and go retrieve her? Um, let's go ahead and try that. Fantastic, so you'll do it. I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate your taking the time to help. So I'm guessing maybe, I'll let this finish. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there and be able to hang off the roof the other side. I'm terribly sorry, the quiet climber. Okay, so I think I know what to do here. Um, hey, we got a rupee! Um, I'm gonna go ahead and try something here. There's a bug up there, I want to get it. Come here, bug. Get it! God dang it. Get it, 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 Go ahead and climb this again. Get up here. Ah! Alright, I think uh, we go over here. Come on! Ah! Well, guys, you know what? I'm going to end it off here because this is the basic, basically, and it'll be a good part to end it off. So, in the next episode, a po not Pokemon. Wow, I'm so used to saying Pokemon now. In the next episode of The Legend of Zelda, Skyward Sword, we'll be continuing on and see if we can even get that uh, dog up there. And we'll continue on to see what we can do next because I have no idea what we're going to do. So, let's, we'll see what we can do next. See you guys then.